Cornwall. Woo, woo, woo. We're in Cornwall. We came here yesterday, which you would have seen a little bit of. Woo, 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 woo. Oh, I thought Lena had the zoomies then, but it was the door. There's Chloe coming in. You would have seen a few clips of this, well, us arriving potentially, little clips of last night and clips of where we're staying. We're basically staying on this like a maze in this amazing Airbnb, which is located in between Senan and Gwenda, which if you guys have watched my previous Cornwall vlogs, you'll know that it's kind of like my favorite little area in Cornwall. And usually I'd stay with my grandparents, which I am doing from Friday onwards with my family, but I've come down with Jamie, Chloe and Eli and Miss Lena Rue. And we're spending like a little few days here and just showing Chloe and Eli like one of my favorite places in the world, basically. Why, what's with the shuffling going on? <laughs> You see that? I you want to say hi to the vlog? Say hi to the vlog, hey? You want to say hi? Oh. She's the sweetest girl in the world. Honestly, yeah. Chloe has brought up the most cuddly little sweetie. You want to get on? Come on then. Okay then. So, um, anyway, we are here for like four or five days and I'm just showing the guys around and just showing them how much I love this place and I'm actually going to create a guide for once of like my favourite things to do in this area because it really is one of my favourite places in the world and I don't really know why I've never done one. Um, but I went for a really nice morning run this morning and did some movement in the garden and then we had an amazing breakfast. Which set up out there. Right. I'll leave some pictures on the screen here. And now we're heading out for a stroll along Senan and then for lunch and then I'll show you guys what else we get up to. Come on then, woohoo! <laughs> Off she goes! <laughs> and I'll also leave down below this Airbnb. So I actually made a mistake where it's basically a double bed and then two rooms with bump beds. I didn't realise that when I was booking because the pictures show the double bedroom with two different like linen bedding things on and like the setup looked completely different and it was me being stupid reading only that it sleeps six people so me and jerry are actually in the bump beds and bearing in mind he's six foot two he fits on the bump beds so it's working really good it's just like being a kid again and we're actually well we slept okay last night jay was completely out so i feel like the bump beds are comfy so far really enjoying how was your sleep guys in your double bed it was great it was great it was absolutely Great. Loved it. Apart from, yeah, just getting a bit of hot in the morning. Yeah, it was very warm for all of us, wasn't it? So apart from that, it's very overexposed. <laughs> apart from that, it is just lovely here. And yeah, so that would be the only thing I... What is happening it's to the... very overexposed. Oh, there we go. We're coming back to life. Um, apart from the bed situation, he actually... The guy that owns this Airbnb owns seven all kind of next to each other around here. All sleep different amounts of people. There's one that sleep eight, there's one that sleep 10, and the one next to us sleeps two people. And then you've got this loft glass one, which is like a few houses up that also sleeps two. And so I'll basically leave the Airbnb details linked down below and you guys can run o like run through them, run over them, have a look at them. Honestly, can you tell that I haven't had my coffee and I'm kind of not functioning properly yet. It's been a while. Usually I have my coffee by 7 like a.m. and it's now nearly 12 and I haven't had it. So I'm surprised I don't have a coffee headache, which is a plus. But anyway, I will show you more details of this beautiful little spot later on as well. But just look at this kitchen view. It's like my dream. And then over there, you can see Senan. And guess what, guys? What, guys? The tide has gone out and it's looking turquoise. <laughs> Woo! And it's now Miss Lena Rue's lunchtime before we go and have our lunchtime. Yeah. Sorry, can you cope with her? Turquoise! Look at Woo her. Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> turquoise! Hey, baby! Is it dinner time? She did the coldest. Okay, dinner time. <laughs> Now, we walked along from Senna after lunch. I don't think I picked up the camera. And we have come to Porf Kano. We've got an ice cream. I got mint chocolate chip. Chloe got blackcurrant and cream. So did Jay. And then Eli got a vanilla and it's 10 out of 10. So and good. Chloe's is better than mine, but. Oh! No. Please don't trip. 
guys, I am so clumsy today. Do, I slipped down a rock and the boys <laughs> thought I was crying after I slipped down the rock. I keep stubbing, I just stubbed my toe on a rock. I, I just, yeah. Anyway, we are at Porthcurno. I'm gonna show you guys the views. It, the sun has come out, the wind has stopped. It's unreal. Little blackberry. Blackberry? I don't wanna get them. Oh my God. Wow. Cornish ice cream hits different. me and Eli in the sea went for a swim at Porth Kerno, which I haven't done in years because I actually find the waves lovely down there but there's basically a drop in the sea and today it wasn't too bad so I would have left those clips in I found it a little bit hard to get in initially but we got in and now me and Chloe have just come down to like the sand dunes just down from the cottage we're staying in because the boys are on dinner duty tonight which is actually quite nice I don't like I don't live with Jay, so I am i don't get cooked for. I haven't experienced that yet. Um, obviously, we've done little evenings where we've made stuff together, but we've actually never really spent the time in our homes because of the space that we've got doing that. So I'm excited for a little dinner. And then me and Chloe are on dessert duty tonight. And yeah, we're just out actually getting some content bits, but also enjoying a glass of wine in the sun. Chloe's just over here having a little crouch. <laughs> you know how hard it is in the sun like we're squinting like this aren't we <laughs> i love that set though so much on you the color is stunning and also i think ugh, just every photo i take of chloe i'm just blown away she should be in magazines guys like you know something? this um yeah this set is like oh, i keep flicking sand in the only freaking <laughs> can i show you them hold on <laughs> go <laughs> can anyone see that <laughs> How much sand is flicking up into Chloe's oh, bum? God. Chloe is going to have so much sand in her pants. Yeah, I don't have sandy bum. Sandy bum, but I love this set. Um, it's from a, a brand called Sorry, Rapa Nui. not great angle from me. Brand um, uh, called Rapa Nui, and they're like a sustainable, like ethical brand. Oh, it's um, beautiful. And it's like a linen piece. It is beautiful. And, um, it also comes in like a really lovely sage green colour. <sighs> and then the shirt can come in like an oatmeal kind of natural linen colour. And they've also wow. got... um linen trousers as well yeah how cute it's so cute and like the little shorts have got like a little waistband so you can adjust it, it. very got comfy pockets. we love the pockets love we pocket. love pockets so. um stunning and the color on you is thanks chef's kiss anyway we are enjoying i think we're gonna actually drink more of our wine while we're here before going back maybe have a bit of downtime from being a dog mountain chloe yeah. she's I'm in my, my wine. no swap with me i'll eat it i'll have it um just get the bug out and i'll have it you have my one. No, don't worry. Hang on, I'll take a picture. <laughs> Hold on, I only need to take a picture of the fly. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I will keep you guys updated and show you guys dinner. Um, sorry, I've been a bit MIA. I've been really just soaking up being here. Um, I have needed this more. No, I'm not going to cry. I'm not going to cry. <laughs> I have needed this more than I realised. Anyway. Love you, Chloe. Love you. Woohoo. Okay quick change for dinner i've just put on this jumper and chloe's massive sun earrings oh i'm slipping how stunning are they i will take you guys downstairs and show you the little table setup also i am filming on my phone for this vlog because i basically ordered the little wind protector for my mic but it hasn't arrived and it's so windy here so i just want it to be nice sound hopefully not too bad sound which will be actually better than having <laughs> A massive like wind sound throughout every single clip so yeah anyway in the satin trousers again a bit of a clashing cream but i feel like just comfy for dinner <laughs> Thank you. 
Bemba, guys. You can actually walk from Senan, which is just over there, all the way along the pathway to Bemba, which is my favorite beach in the world. And it's also the spot to surf. I don't know if you guys can see the surfer there. Surfer's there, look at them go. Woohoo! We're on Gwenda! Woohoo! Guys are there? I've been the worst vlogger in the world. I've been fully in just like chill mode. And yesterday I would have just inserted loads of clips basically from my phone because I didn't film in the right format for YouTube. But anyway, it is the next day, which is our last full day with the guys behind me here. Um, and then I'm spending time with my family, but we have come on the coastal path, which goes from basically the top of Mausel to La Morna. And it's quite close to my family home here. So it's something that I do a lot when I'm here and in lockdown, when I was here with my dad, I basically just ran this or walked this a lot. And it's absolutely beautiful. It's the nicest day. We're actually not gonna walk the full coastal path to La Morna because it's a bit of a trek and we've got Lena and we don't want to like knock her out. So we're just going for a nice little stroll. Did a little bit of shopping in town, which I'll show you some of the stuff I got later. And um, we went to a place called Seven Stones, which is on the high street in Penzance. And it is amazing. You can get a coffee in store and they do loads of cool like Carhartt and a few independent like brands and women's wear and men's wear. And I got a really nice jacket and some New Balance trainers, which I'm so happy with. So yeah, I will show you guys those later. And yeah, we're just going to the little viewpoint where there's a bench here because I want to show the guys my little walk, my little stroll that I do and um, take them along. And then we're going to head to La Morna Cove and have a little bit of lunch, sit in the sunshine there. And then we've kind of just got the afternoon chilling at our little cottage, soaking it up, packing, just enjoying the sun, really. I might try and get in the sea again um, because the tide seems to be low in the mornings and then by like 6 p.m it gets really high again so we've got like a nice stint in the day where there's literally just sand and the sea so yeah i'm excited for that we did also go in yesterday but i didn't take my phone along for that um as we were filming quite a big job or well, chloe was helping me with a really really big job that i was filming so yeah anyway that is the update take you guys along for today Thank you. 
Mm-hmm.